Hey guys! What's up? Alpha Lion Simba here, and welcome to another animal memoir. I've talked about birds before on this segment, so now it's time for me to talk about one you've probably never heard of before, and that is the Cuban Red Macaw. Let's get started. Hence its name, the Cuban Red Macaw lived on the island of Cuba. The Cuban Red Macaw was one of the smallest macaws at about 45 to 50 centimeters or 18 to 20 inches long. Very little is known about this bird's behavior. However, it's been reported that it vocalized loudly like its Central American relatives and that it lived in pairs or families. Nothing is known about its breeding habits or its eggs. The one reported nest was in a hollow in a palm. In the wild, the Cuban red macaw ate fruits, seeds of the royal palm and china berry tree, as well as other seeds and shoots. Hunting played an enormous part in the extinction of the Cuban red macaw. The Cuban people heavily hunted this parrot and ate its flesh, and felled trees to obtain the chicks, which were then sold to the pet trade. In addition to being locally kept as pets, the birds were often traded to Europeans as pets, and it was first brought back to Europe by the explorer Christopher Columbus before the end of the 1400s. The Cuban red macaw was reportedly stupid and slow to escape, and was therefore easily caught. The last Cuban red macaw was shot in 1864, and after that, the species was officially declared extinct. Well, that was it. My animal memoir on the Cuban red macaw. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. And now, a moment of silence for the Cuban red macaw. Alpha Lion Simba.